so one of the things that the club wanted to do is to increase our <clears throat> increase the number of people actually working in the EDI area because previously we had our EDI lead Sam Giddings who's done a fantastic job in in promoting the club and, and, and leading the club to that advanced standard so I'm working now closely with Sam and um, assisting basically with that with that work and um, Sam one you know just one person so having doubled the number of people that are working on there hopefully will help us to to achieve what we need to do to, to to retain our advanced status when we next go to the panel so in a nutshell that's the that's the sort of the, the role the disability access side of it is something i've been doing for a few years anyway as part of the slo role and that's about making sure that our provision for disabled fans is is as good as it can be and about um, trying to improve our provision as and when we can so that work is for me is pretty much continuing as it as it has been for the last few years but now i've got much more focus on the on the edi side of it equality diversity and inclusion so that'll be working with people like the proud hornets and uh, women of watford support group that have just started up but beyond that as well working in local community with um, local community groups from different faiths and different religions and backgrounds so there's an awful lot of work to be done and as i say no one at watford wants to rest on the laurels of being given the advanced standard we want to make sure we go and retain it now for the next for the next couple of years